everybody is Karen Mills and I'm on my high horse about anti-aging products. There are a million different concoctions out there and they all claim to restore, renew, repair, reduce, reverse the signs of aging. And it's impossible to know what to buy. Do I need to boost and hydrate or lift and illuminate? Laminate, that's what I need to do. Aging is hard. And yes, I know that everyone prefers getting older to the alternative, but it's still hard. And yes, I know that the older you get, the wiser you get, and I am very wise. But I still don't want to spend an hour looking for my glasses and then find them on top of my head. And yes, I know that as we age, we're able to create boundaries and we rid ourselves of toxic people, and that's great. But I still don't want to grow a goatee or have a hot flash in the grocery store and have to put a bag of frozen peas on my head. The green giant has saved me more than once. And people say, you should just be grateful to be alive. I'm an ovarian cancer survivor. I am incredibly grateful to be alive. And I give thanks every day. But I still don't want to sneeze and wet my pants. And if it really is all about inner beauty, then why is anti-aging a $50 billion industry? I'll tell you why, because no one wants to look old, especially if you don't feel old. Aging to me is like the movie Titanic. In my mind, I'm young Rose. When I look in the mirror, old Rose. If I was a superhero, I would be the rejuvenator and I would fight free radicals and restore elasticity. Oh, I want to get off my high horse. I need to go try this new product I just ordered. It's supposed to give me a Super glow. I'll let you know how it goes. A miracle in a bottle. That's what I really need. An effing miracle in a bottle. <laughs>